Hi everyone, Lensman Oz and my kids here. We're going to be playing Nuts and Bolts Talked. So this is our new family series. And for those of you who uh, haven't watched before or are new to the channel, etc., um, we'll do our normal intros. I'm, I'm Lensman Oz. Uh, we have Dragon Loon here. Hello. Yeah, we've got Jay Morella at the back. Hi. And Manx over to my left on the picture. Alright, so we thought uh, time for a new family series and what better way to go back than to a questing pack because we played through the full craft pack and if you haven't uh, watched that series please go and check it out on the channel. Uh, but we got to the point where it was kind of, um, yeah, we had a loose end, we were, we were very rich on resources and not much to do. So to give ourselves a little bit of direction, we've, uh, you're, you're out of shot now Jane Rowley. Aww. It's alright, I tipped the camera, it's Hot. fine. Um, so we've, we've gone to a, a um, questing pack. Uh, this one is a little bit tweaked though, so this is kind of, a, kind of an expert mode. So it should give us a little bit more longevity. Uh, so some things are going to be a little bit harder than they normally are. Um, some things are going to be easier if you change mods to make the certain thing but we'll get to that as we go through now the way the pack is uh, the book is not required the books just there to give you some direction so this um, book in itself you can see here um, this is not intended to be a full quest driven experience so you will find a limited amount of quests in here focusing on major objectives so the idea is that it has a progression system and as you can see, if I click on this first series here, we've got all sorts of different bits and materials that we can work our way through to get to an end goal. But plenty of things we could be doing on the on you know on the side sort of thing. There'll be uh, tasks to do and automating things and all sorts of stuff. So without further ado, I guess we should start punching wood, right, kids? Yep. Well, in my case, I need to punch yeah. wood. Then finding. Rocky outcrops. You somewhere. want you want a cave, don't you, Dragon? Yeah, I want my you Dragon want dead again. Well, there's a big hill over there, so you can uh, go to town. Um, I so can make one first. Yeah, looks like Jamrilla's heading up the hill anyway. Uh, the server is on peaceful at the moment. We uh, always like to play the first short amount of uh, time in peaceful mode, just getting our bearings and getting set up. And it's almost night time now, so none of us have a bed. Uh, there is there is flax around, I think, but I don't think I get string. And sheep. Yeah, there's some sheep around. I don't even have tools, so that's that's something we need to start getting into. Is is uh, as I said before, punching wood. Start getting into tools and that sort of stuff. Now I believe there is tinker's construct in this pack, um, and a whole bunch of other bits and materials. Um, I think it's got tinker's tool leveling, so our tools should level up as we use them. Um, I know I'm saying I'm a lot. I apologize for that. Uh, this area <laughs> is um, where we've, well, where I've kind of picked out to build the base. I figured it was a nice sort of flattish area with some some nice features around, a bit of protection from the elements, so to speak, with the uh, the hills here. I've done a little bit of roaming around. We've got uh, it says a a, a a mesa biome, but which is where all this is here. We've got uh, some clays and things like that. We've got some fairly tall mountainous areas, which Jamrilla and Manx are heading over at the moment. We've got a bit of a snowy biome up to the north. Haven't been too far out to the west or the southeast down there, but definitely a, a, a nice sort of area. The uh, world gen, I'm pretty sure, uh, and from memory, let me just, yep, we're using RTG. Uh, so that's part of the pack itself. So they have added all sorts of bits and pieces in. Got a bet already. Yep. You're killing it. You're doing well. No. You've, you've, won, the, you've won the pack, that's it. Yay! Let's make a chest. Don't pull that junk in. Uh, we will need to start getting into tinkers at some point. I do have a lot of junk in my inventory. I don't... Oh, we don't have mouse tweaks. Oh, it's going to suck. 
Uh, I have a berry to eat. Come here, sheep. Come here. I want your wool. I wonder if there's wooden shears in this pack. Let's check. Shears. No. Just the normal ones. Come here. Come here. Here. Give me one wool. Alrighty. I see lots of sheep deaths happening around. So yeah, the realistic terrain gen, I I do hey you can wave. How'd you do that? It's in tech in the text <laughs> thing. T. Yeah, so what do you type? Wave. It's in the emote section. There's an emote section? Goodness yep. me. Oh there it is. Yay! Achieved. Cool. <laughs> It's funny because it's it's um, probably been there for for ages and I've never even looked. Oh, cool, getting all sorts of uh, achievements here. Dump off all this junk. Got a couple of mutton from killing that sheep. Right, uh, let's look into the book. So it wants us to, um, I guess, get started and then build a grindstone, a grindstone from Applied Energy Six Two. Uh, so I guess you know as as it says in the description, this is only just like a guide. It's not going to do a full, you must now build a this, or you must now build a... Dad. Yes? The emotes have my favourite... Face palm. Emo yeah, yes, yes. <laughs> it's hilarious. It is hilarious. Do you want to see one? Already did it. Rawr. <laughs> so, let's get into it. Uh, how much would you got, dragon? Nine. No. I already made myself an axe and a pickaxe. Well, do you want to try and start making the tinkers material, you know, the benches? So make some patterns. I'll get some more wood. Manx, have you been killing you a lot of axe? sheep? No, I don't have an axe. Yeah, take my axe. I was using the crest book. I figured that's what it was used for, right? <laughs> Punching trees. Uh... Manx, are you in charge of getting beds for all of us? Uh, yeah. Awesome. And then I believe Jamarilla's off getting different colours of wood or something, or are you just cruising around, Jamarilla? Building. You're building already? Yep. You're over the hill somewhere. I'm on the top of the second hill, the one that isn't the biggest, but I'm around the bend. Right, well, I can't even see you on the map anymore. That's cool. Uh, do you need some more wood, Dragon? Is 12. I'm looking at how to build the stuff. Uh, so you'll need the patterns, which are planks and sticks in a 2x2. Two two. So, diagonal. Found two sheep over here. Uh, and then you will need a log, a plank, uh, a crafting table, and a chest. We'll make that. And and a uh, a pattern for each of them will make the uh, the stations you need, and you need to just place them down in a specific order to make sure that it's um, easy enough to to use them. There's my floating tree. Here it is. Nothing like UFO trees. Joy. Take that. Sheep over here. Are you right, Manx? Have you got enough wool yet? Or... No, I'm gonna get enough for everyone. Well, uh, Dragon's already got a bed. Where is Tinkers in this thing? Oh, wait, wait. No, wait. Yes, found it. Okay. I think. Your microphone's gone scratchy again. So, having a little bit of a weird thing today where Dragon's microphone just likes being scratchy, and I don't know what it is. There's. One minute it's perfectly fine, and the next minute it decides, nope, I'm going to make it sound like um, she's rubbing it on her on her head or something. But um, we'll struggle through. Is there wood in there somewhere? Um, what did you say the blank plates, plank patterns need to be made out of? Do we have tinkers? Yeah, but they're yeah. made out of sticks and treated stick. And paper. Have they changed it? Oh, 
terrible. I guess we're not using this real early. Oh, they're, they're nasty. So there you go. We're not using Tinkers now. We'll have to use normal. I guess that pushes us straight to uh, getting into some of the... the That's the... your stuff. Oh. <laughs> oh, well. Why the bed... Why did I get the bed? It's my bed. Give it back. I just put it in the chest. All right, then. I guess we're... um. Not doing it that way. No. Hey, okay, set my spawn. That line will look for a better. Well, I just made a bed because I was waiting. <laughs> All right, let's look into this. And so we can't use tinkers yet. We're going to have to use basic tools, which means um, boring, boring wooden tools and stone tools, and then mining up iron and. Doing all that sort of regular jazz that comes with regular Minecraft. Oh, there is wood under here. I'm going to finish this axe off because it's going to break. There it goes. Got a few beds made, buddy. Alright, well, I guess, I guess this is definitely pointing us in the right direction then. So, we need to make all sorts of stuff there's a mining um the looks like the mining dimensions in this one which is cool uh so let's look we need a grindstone grindstone needs quartz of some description and cobble stone and some sticks so let's you know let's just do the basic things Wooden pickaxe. Not that I need a sword at the moment, but I'll grab one. Sleep. You want to sleep? I'm already am. Um... Okay then. Is anyone else ready to sleep? Don't have a bed. Oh, Manx was making you one. He's having an interesting way of making a. I'm marking my territory. With what? Wooden planks. Okay. So I'm going to go mining then. Where are you, dragon? You're halfway up the hill already. Yep, I'm inside. Pun punched a hole in the wall. Ready to yep. go. Gee, I'm glad monsters aren't on. Jeez, it's dark. <laughs> it's very, very dark. Well, already punched a hole and made a small room. We've got banded iron. A weird one. I'm gonna get some cobbles so we can make a furnace. Can I mine this banded iron? Yes, I can. I don't know what I get from it. Oh, for vein miner. Oh, I should install vein miner in the pack. That would be helpful. A little cheaty, but helpful. So I guess this is your, your, your normal start of any oh i found some coal any minecraft game is a furnace finding some materials you can't make the crafting station smaller you can't make a furnace you have to get compressed cobblestone clay and sand nice i love it i love it already furnace i found peat coal ore yeah, that's not that bad really it's just Nine, eighteen, twenty-seven. My maths is bad. Nine, five, forty-five. This is right? silly. What's silly? The building. Why? Because you need how? What type of? Just, just. You, oh, you can use andesite for stone. So. Well, this helped quite a bit. So I know I know how to make the cobblestone compressed. Yeah, you just nine cobble. It's not going to be that bad. I'm no going stress. to start making a house. You're going to start making a house? Is that where you're building it over there? Is it your house or is it everyone's house? I literally got three beds so it can be for three people. Well, you may need to deliver Jamarella's bed to her up at her... Uh... He said either I go down there and get it or I don't get it at all. Oh, she... <laughs> 
There's a sheep in my house. Die. Apparently melts into a hundred middle buckets of molten bloom. I have no idea what we do with this. Ooh, a bloomery. Whatever a bloomery is. How do you make a bloomery? That's doable. Rock hounding ores. So interesting. We might be uh, going that route. Usage. We need a forge hammer for that, which is just chiseled stone and some sticks. Okay. Okay. Goodness. Maybe I bit off more than we can chew. But that's fine. You'll find a way. That's what it's all about. Whatever this brown stuff is. Peat coal. Do I need shovel for that? No, it looks like I need a, a pick. Okay, a bit of peat coal. I guess we can use that as some sort of peat drying pallet. Okay. What can you do with dried peat? I found some banded iron. Yeah, I was, I was starting to grab that before, buddy. You can make torches with it. Coal pellets. Coal blocks. Oh my gosh. What? What? I think we're going to be doing a lot of work in between episodes with mining. I think we're going to be getting all sorts of materials. So just to make a furnace, we're going to need at least 45 stone. And some clay and some sand, as you said. So that alone, in itself, is a lot of work. Still, different. We've got 38 so far. Grab a couple of extras. There's wolves on top of the mountain. Cool. We don't have bones. It's because there's no monsters. I've been digging out my little cave. Well, I mean, you'll have plenty of cobble and dirt. It's only cobble at the moment. Okay, I'm going to get some andesite. A oh, granite, sorry, I think this is. Yeah, granite. Look at this. Hopefully I can make the grindstone. Now we just need to find clay. So one of these mods makes a type of iron that you can get uh like before before stone i That's have actually doors. kind of cool mm -hmm. i need two clay and a sand Let's see if we can find some hopefully there's some out on the beach you have doors do you on your on your cave a door but i have two more if anyone wants any Yes, please. Oh, wow, I found a ton of peat. Ooh, and some copper. Ooh, might be able to get into something with copper. I don't know whether we can use it yet. And what's this? Ciderite. Never heard of it. It's an iron ore of some description. Anyway, we've got some copper and some more peat down there. We'll have to make a peat pallet, but I need clay. Clay. Let's grab a little bit of clay. I mean, we're probably going to need a ton of it anyway. I'm not sure what the Tinker's uh, smeltery requires to build. I haven't looked that up yet. I'm, I'm a little bit scared to look it up, I must admit. See what they've done with it. If they've made the changes that they've made just to a furnace, what have they done to that? So it'll be a... stuck underwater by our lily pads. Uh, smelt. Clay. Let's have, a Let's have a look at the smeltery controller. The smeltery controller requires a block of cold coke. Which Where requires a coke oven. Which Where are you? I'm I'm down here why. I'm coming towards you. Coke bricks. 
There's a coke bricks. It's that one, isn't it? Coke brick. Requires nether bricks, seared bricks, and tiny coal. Seared bricks is grout. Grout? No, the recipe hasn't changed for grout. <laughs> you came all that way just to face palm. Yep. Awesome. I love your dedication. We've got plenty of clay and gravel and stuff out here, so we'll be able to make the, the seared bricks. Uh, for the moment, I want to make the furnace, so we've got a way of cooking stuff. Be a good start. Get string from some flax. All right, uh, so that and then we've got a furnace. I know it's not really needed yet, but hey, furnace. I can make my urn. Um, can I make tiny coal? Yes, I can. There's peat coal. I'm gonna make a pallet. Peat. There's peat coal. Yeah, but I need to make a peat drying pallet, which is some wood and some sticks. I can do that. Ah. I need some slabs. Yep, peat drying pallet. And it takes, oh no, it takes all of them. I can chuck them all in there, that's cool. <coughs> I don't know how long it takes. Probably a very long time. Yeah, a very long time. <laughs> so we have a furnace. I've got some steak. Steak. Uh, let's. Dump some more junk. We are going to need. Let's just make 400 millibuckets of molten bloom. So, this ciderite I found is better than the banded iron. Uh, so, we need. What was this again? To make a bloomery. Bloomery is another furnace. So, I need another 45 uh, cobble. And then I need a bunch of stone bricks, so I'm going to need a, a fair bit. But we've got some food. I'm putting some pork chops in the chest if anyone wants them. Can I melt this copper? Nope. Can't smelt ores. Awesome. I love it. It's great. Grindstone. Cobble. Stone. Wooden gear. So we just need some surtis. We're going to have to do some... Um, some hunting for service quartz. Let's get a chest for my ongoing stuff. So we've got chest and we've got that. Two cobble, one, two, three of them, two of them, and then all we need is a little bit of quartz. So I am guess I'm going to go and do some more mining. You know what, let's just, can I do this? Darn. Couple of chests. All right, let's go and dig something up. I really needed torches, didn't I? I just wasted my uh, my piece of coal. Where did you end up living, Jamarella? Up up on the hill, or are you just over there, near spawn? Up, I can 68 see sixty-eight meters up from spawn. I can see your little thing. I'm going to head over to where you are, just because I want to. So I guess you can see that this pack is going to be a little bit different, a little bit more difficult. Um, probably going to require us to do a little bit more off camera, which is fine. I see your house. Maybe you're going to put a balcony on that because that'd be fantastic. Yeah, it's going to be there soon. What a view, even though my view distance is a little bit low. What a great view. Stop falling off your house. Fell off the roof. Well, 
lucky it's in Minecraft and not in real life because you wouldn't have survived. No, I would have survived. Just. Just. True. It's a little bit dark today. Yep. All right. So this episode hasn't been much, but it's what we, you know, introduced to the complexities of the pack. Um, we are going to need to do lots in between. Why is the sign here? What's the sign say? This is my base. Someone made me a sign. Almost got some peat. Be able to make a torch with the peat. Apparently mud bricks can be turned into peat too. Which is just liquid dirt in a casting basin, which is interesting. Dry peat. Yeah, we can make one torch with a piece of dry peat. Oh my gosh. I have a better idea. What's that? You got some coal? Hey, charcoal. We could do that. Maybe. Maybe. Let's see if it's possible. <gasps> it might be. Lee what? Hey what? Charcoal lump. Block of charcoal. Charcoal Another. block. Okay. Ash cloud. Oh, you Mighty get two. Charcoal. You can get uh Get two torches from a lump of charcoal. Wow. Just what I've always wanted is two torches. <laughs> At least yours is bright. Wow. So, I mean, I, I guess wood is a, a resource that's uh, fairly easy to come by. But I'm, I'm guessing, let's, let's see, do we have... Um, no, we don't have progressive automation, so we can't get into that early on. Got all sorts of stuff. Got actually additions, but I'd say that's going to be gated behind something. What else is in here? Some stuff that I've... Oh, Ars Magica. I haven't played with that in years. Uh, it looks like Avaricia is in here as well. Blood magic, Britannia, Chisel, uh, Deep Resonance, Dark Utilities is in here, that's alright. Draconic Evolution, Embers, Ender.io, Extra Utilities 2, Forestry, else we got lots of uh, pages of stuff gendistries in here obviously uh, immersive engineering because we're going to need coke ovens and stuff industrial craft uh, iron backpacks iron chests modular power suit mechanism Uh, yeah, still mechanism. Missing pieces. I don't know what that mod is. Natura. I have four torches. Open computers. Pams. Pressure pipes. Why That's they make stuff so complicated? To make it go forever. Sigh. What else we got? Uh, you can see where my base is now. Arc tools. Redstone Arsenal. Yes, you can. It's now a lit up blob on the side of the hill. Yay. Random things. What else we got? Oh, what's in here? Is there a... I don't think there is. I kind of want like a, a basic tree farm set up. We've got um, roots is in this one. Uh, simply jet packs. Did I miss something? Did I miss... Calculator in here because don't think I missed it. Cyberware is in here. No, 
Didn't miss it. Anyway, there's so much uh, stuff in here. We'll have to find the bits and pieces we need. Looks like Woot's in here. We've got Thermal Expansion. We've got all sorts of bits and pieces. Uh, but we'll, we'll come to a, a solution. I'll go mining now. And next episode, we'll have enough materials, I guess, to start questing through the book a little bit. Because obviously, this is... You know, if I'm if I'm struggling to make a grindstone and a bucket, etc., then it's going to be a um, fairly intensive pack to uh, to work our way through. But we can do it. I'm sure, we can. It'll give us all something to focus on. Anyway, thank you everyone for watching. Leave those comments in that section down there, somewhere below the video. Uh, let us know what you think. Let us know if this is. Uh, Something you're going to enjoy. I think we're going to struggle a bit, but um, should be interesting. Why hasn't maybe the peat can only dry during the day? Um, yeah, I think we'll definitely wrap it up here. Thank you for watching. Let's say goodbye, my children. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. And I hope you all join us for the next episode. Bye now.